The Ministry of Health, in partnership with UNICEF and the European Union, will commemorate world breastfeeding throughout the whole of August. As the ministry prepares for the execution of major activities in rural Gambia, the executive director of Nana Modufal reminded the gathering of the importance of mothers knowing the significance of exclusive breastfeeding. We had to start breastfeeding within the first one or two minutes. What comes out of the breast is what we call four milk, and that four milk is just water. And that is what quenches the thirst of the child. But after a couple of three, four minutes, the water is drained, and what you get next is the nutrients. That is why you get your carbohydrate, your proteins, and your fats, and other minerals and uh, vitamins. So if a woman is breastfeeding, and you put the breast child on the breast for one minute, two minutes, and you put the child again to another breast, the left breast or the right breast, that means the child is just getting water. The one-month celebration will take the form of radio talk shows, community dialogue and TV banter bars. Major activities will be done in the rural Gambia where a lack of exclusive breastfeeding is predominant. This calls for concerted efforts to disseminate the required information as the Director of Health Promotion, Modin Jai, urged journalists to make the information accessible to the general public. We already have existing program which we want to use because as part of our ag agreements and MOU between us and the existing media outlets. Either at regional level, somebody coordinates. So either sends a nurse or a public officer or somebody else, you know, conversing with the topic, who will just go to the radio on that particular time. Breast milk, according to experts, is highly nutritious and contributes to a lot of health benefits and increasing the IQ level of children. Journalists took turns to ask pertinent questions relating to the situation of working women and breastfeeding. To me, there is a segment of people left behind. And how can we get them on board to implement this exclusive breastfeeding that those are the working mothers? The best practice is for that mother and child to be together. But as you rightly say, working mothers have that dilemma. But six months is enough for exclusive breastfeeding. By then, you can introduce complementary feeding. When you are going to work, you either take the baby along to the work site, if permissible, or you express your breast milk and leave it for the child. The Gambia has come a long way in inculcating the idea of exclusive breastfeeding, where efforts are being made to raise the number of exclusive breastfeeders in the country from 47% to 50% as demanded by the World Health Assembly by 2023. The World Breastfeeding Week is a great moment to encourage more women to breastfeed their children. For GRTS News, I am Fatou Elika Muloshi.